Christians in America, they know they're like, they're like dogs. Now, I, I've had a German shepherd around me somewhere for 25, 30 years. And far as, you know, as far as I'm concerned, that's the only dog regional. They keep moving the ark. But you take, uh, but you take, but you take, you take my German Shepherd. If my German Shepherd comes in, I can, I can come on my German Shepherd and I can say, "Good dog, good dog, good dog," <laughs> and he'll lie down, cower down, stick his tail between his legs and drop his ears. And he come there, and I can say, "Hello there, you son. Give that and pup. I'm gonna take you out in the backyard and shoot you." And he'll just smile and wag his tail, you know, because he don't know what's going on. You know why that is? Because he's listening to the tone of my voice. That's what a lot of you are doing right now. I get more criticism than that than anything I do. I just don't like the tone of his voice. Well then, blow it out your nose. You know what's wrong with you? You're like an animal. You don't hear what I'm saying. You're not listening. People in America gotten so full of love themselves, so full of themselves. Think of a guy talks nice and smooth and quiet and smiles at him and pats him in the back. He loves him. And if he yells at him like I do and spits and growls and howls and pounds the pulpit, he don't love him. You're a fool. That's what you are. F double O L, that's what you are. Well, that's how politicians get votes, man. Don't you know that? Kiss babies and pat them on the head and shake hands. That's how they do it. You never have to worry about people like me and John Mitchell, you know, and, and Billy Kinnor and, and, and Carl Like. You never have to worry about folks like us. You know why? We can't fool anybody. See? Beware the wolves that come to you in sheep's clothing. I'm not a wolf in sheep's clothing. I'm a sheep in wolf's clothing. 